Well, hello there, children. I thought it was time we drew this f British character. I'm going to start by drawing a circle for this lovely warm character's head. Another larger circle for his upper body, and a larger still for his lower body. And I'm sure you've guessed already who this lovely character is. The original designs for this character were made by a lovely man called E. H. Shepherd. Now, as you can see, I've drawn a slight banana shape there for his nose, or his snout, I should say. Now I'm going to draw a small curve for his ear, and another curve. And then a small dot for his eye, and a slight curve for his forehead. Now when you're drawing shepherd-like illustrations, you shouldn't worry about smooth lines. Very sketchy. Drag that line down and connect the two circles. Draw another oval for his leg. Another oval. You must learn to draw ovals. I owe a great deal to Mr. Shepherd. He was a great inspiration to me whilst I was learning illustration. So now we have the main frame. I'm going to use a fountain pen to try and capture that shepherd like line. Always drag your lines down. The good thing is, Shepherd's lines weren't exact, so there's not no need to worry too much. And this particular drawing seems to have muddy paws. Now this will be a good chance, or chance I should say, to practice your hatching. Remembering at all times, keep your hand very loose relaxed. I've just been listening to the radio production of Winnie the Pooh voiced by Stephen Fry. I rather quite like it. Hence the silly voice. Now again, this is my own interpretation. Not exactly how Shepherd drew Pooh, but roughly the same. Incidentally, or ironically, not sure which, 
the American voice, the original American voice that is, by Sterling Holloway, charming man, shares the same birthday as I. Or I, sh I should say, I share the same birthday as he. Our birthdays being the 4th of January. I have the same birthday as Sterling Holloway, voice of Winnie the Pooh, and narrator of. Uh, what, what was it now? Peter and the Wolf. He was also the snake from the Jungle Book. Also born on the 4th of January was Sir Isaac Newton. I wonder, do you share your birthday with anyone famous, viewers? Do tell me. There we are. We're practically done. And the key is to practice your shading and your cross hatching. Pooh is an excellent character to practice your hatching. Start with a simple character like Pooh. Learn to draw light and shade. I think that that'll do. There we are, I'm going to sign that. Jim Shepherd. Scratch. Thank you for watching. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comments below. Goodbye.